Is it normal to bleed after a positive pregnancy test? It's important to note that bleeding after a positive pregnancy test doesn't always mean a chemical pregnancy. Bleeding is also common during implantation, which is when the embryo attaches to the uterus. This process can rupture or damage tiny blood vessels along the uterine lining, resulting in the release of blood. Is implantation bleeding heavy? The bottom line. Implantation bleeding can be one of the earliest signs of pregnancy. However, implantation bleeding isn't usually heavy unless you have an underlying bleeding disorder. If you experience heavy bleeding outside of your menstrual cycle, make an appointment with your healthcare provider. Can you still be pregnant if you bleed a little? Pregnant women can have some light irregular bleeding during pregnancy, but it should not be like a normal period. Dot dot dot. The irregular bleeding or spotting that can occur during pregnancy is often a dark brown or a light pinkish color. It should not be enough bleeding to fill pads or tampons over a few days. How long can spotting last in early pregnancy? Only about a third of pregnant women experience implantation bleeding after they get pregnant, but it's considered a normal symptom of pregnancy. In most cases, implantation spotting only lasts from a few hours to a couple days, but some women report having implantation spotting for up to seven days. Should I take a pregnancy test if I'm spotting? Bleeding during other times during the menstrual cycle. Implantation bleeding can be confused with other periods of bleeding. Dot dot dot. A pregnancy test will normally be positive shortly after implantation bleeding, but it still may take days. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification for more of these videos.